all right guys welcome back to the channel uh sunday update that's what the lately the videos have been so that's how we're we're keeping it rolling hot rod power tour is what three weeks or two weeks away three weeks. three weeks away it is uh 8 19 today so yeah we're kind of behind the eight ball like we're really realizing that uh it might not happen with the fury might be taking the cadillac we don't know but we're we're still hitting it hard um just you know we got parts in now it's just a matter of time and hopefully here's the update bam right there it is transmission is poor apart my dad there he is and he's been hard at it. you can tell by his his shirt looks like mine dirty but um that's one reason why i take it apart you see that transmission pan looks horrible we're thinking it's original there's no real signs of any replacement or anything but uh there's your torque flight cast iron what they call this thing like 877 or something something weird cast iron got it tore apart there's new bell housing because the old one was cracked or new used bell housing um you know there's the inside of it if you guys ever wonder tore down completely uh dad had to take this yeah that was that's how you have to get the bands out it's through here there's the levers for the what is it servos yep band servos. yep band servos so yep so that's her. That's that update. We got over here. We got let's see. This car had we do have no, new torque converter came in, and we got our parts for it. So that's good. Which we've had that this torque converter. We're kind of debating on using the old one, but seeing what the, is going on, we're not. So yeah, here's everything laid out on the table. It looks pretty good. We ain't got it tore tore apart. Valve bias has got to come apart. Pump probably be tore apart and cleaned a little bit. Got some surface rust on one of the drums because this thing we're thinking had moisture in it. That's before taking it apart. But uh, yeah, rear pump. If you guys didn't know, I read an article that this car was sold with an automatic because you could push start it. The rear pump makes it where you can get pressure. Part brake. It looks pretty good. Needs to be cleaned up. Housing. Where are those gears that you found, Dad? Let's see. Oh, here they are. So we had some mystery stuff show up. It's a little dark in here, but. So we had these, uh, we're thinking they're speedometer gears that somebody's had problems with in the past. Because there is the the one that's in it. Looks awful new, right? Looks pretty much brand new. And these two things were in the back tail section. So that's what we're thinking is uh, what those are. They're nice and greasy. They look like gears. So hopefully we don't have the same issues that somebody else had because that's two that we know of. <laughs> so we'll see um back tail section we got our new bands these are actually from the same people down there or i think they're up in new jersey they reline the old ones so got those there's all the rest of the parts kind of get you ain't the brightest in here but you know if you guys are wondering what's in a 59 fury sport fury with the hp transmission this is it this has two pumps there's a front pump yeah yep front pump right there there's a normal front pump and it's got the gears Yep. Normal. there's the bottom section of it, right? Yep. Yep. And then it has a rear pump to be able to push start. Yep. That's how you're able to push start it because it can make pressure through the tail through the tail shaft and uh, get the clutches to engage so you can push start. That's what I've been told. And I will say that's a weird design because I've never we've been doing transmission work for how long? Mm, too, <laughs> for many years. too many years, right? So as you can also see the update, the love trucks out. My dad came home and cleaned up the trailer. We got the love truck in the trailer, so that way it can work in the, the nice cool basement, which is always a plus because it's like 90 degrees now. So let's go in here and see this lower shop, see if uh, anything's changed down here. Getting dark. As you can imagine, full day. But neighbor's been doing an awesome job. You can kind of see the yard now. They've been doing a really good job of, and that is a NASCAR body, if anybody ever wanted in the pictures show car body not a not a track body probably should sell that one day <laughs> let it go to crap first <laughs> yeah the, the the vinyl's worth more than the body is i think Fire this thing up yep you don't know phil's been down here at all i know he's in here the other day because i've seen the steering wheel was moved over here to the uh this bench but Yeah, Phil's doing all the work to the rear end. He's doing all the work to the rear end um, at his house. He brought everything over to his house because he uh, could fit it on a schedule a little bit more. And uh, so he's doing that. He's got the control arms. He says he's got all the bushings pushed into them on the bushings. I think he had like one set of bushings to do and the leaf spring bushings to press in, the front ones. 
and it should be back going back together. So, so kind of the update is we got uh, still gotta freshen this thing up a little bit, and main thing is gonna be us all the suspension work, all the suspension work, cleaning, painting. Like, I don't want to rush it for the trip, that's for sure. But whew, me, we've been working hard, and I don't know if it's gonna happen because we ain't we we, we, ain't, we ain't got the time. But it's, it, we're gonna try, that's for sure. But here, here's all the parts laid out from last week. I don't think anything's really changed. Which is how it goes. You wait on parts, and it's not like he, well, like Phil's not doing nothing. It's just doing anything over there. So, as always, hit the like button, subscribe. Hopefully, we will be on the Power Tour, for sure. It might not be in the Fury. We're hoping it is. Like, we're all out trying to get it done. It will definitely be there with either the Cadillac or the Fury. But uh, I'll see you guys in the tour.